there's an element of one-upping yourself, right? Yeah. That's, that's, that's a, <laughs> How do a we very, do four again, but bigger and better? <laughs> I mean, that, that exact sentiment applies to almost the entire game. Mm -hmm. um, and it is uh, absolutely a challenge. And, and some people have said that we need to stop treating that as a, a, as a strategy because it, we will reach a point where uh, we won't be able to one-up ourselves. But um, right now, we feel like that is future Playground Games' problem and not one, that, not one that we need to worry about because uh, I think this probably is one of our most uh, spectacular showcases uh, we've put together so far. Uh, Andy actually designed this. So uh, Andy, our, our resident driver, who um, you, you may hear the voice of very soon, uh, was actually the, the level designer who uh, put this showcase together. So uh, if anybody can drive it in a perfect fashion, it will be him. That's added. Uh, no pressure. <laughs> yeah, thanks. Yeah. It's also a new car, isn't it, Andy? Yeah, yeah. This is uh, Ken Block's V2 Escort Cosworth. Uh, it's uh, an amazing car built with sort of uh, modern rally specs in mind with all the aerodynamics and uh, insane grip that those cars have these days. And of course, an amazing livery. Amazing livery. Which says Forza Horizon on it as well, which is lovely. <laughs> um, yeah, it's. It's not, is it like 300 horsepower? Uh, like? Yeah, I think it's 370 horsepower. Okay, 370. So not crazy powerful, but super lightweight um, and can can really move. Um, because it's light as well, the brakes are awesome. So even in a, some of the tricky driving maneuvers you'll have to pull in a minute, it is possible to slow down really fast. Yeah, and, uh, and Ken Block's uh, Jim Carner videos are a, a massive inspiration for me as well. Oh, wow. Uh, what, for the showcase event? Process. Yeah. Oh, okay. uh, it, was a, it was something that I considered when I was sort of making it. If, um, if Horizon was to make one of the Jim Carner videos, you know, what would we do? So that's the sort of uh, the lens that I would take. The event. Right. <laughs> A plane becomes bikes. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect timing, right into Guanajuato, um, which is our main city in the game. That's those good brakes. Yeah. And just like we've shown in, uh, you know, previous previous footage, Guanajuato is like super beautiful city with uh, mm. uh, undulate, um, undulating roads and an underground uh, tunnel network. Um, there's actually a mural right there by Spake, one of the mural artists, um, our Mexican mural mural artists. Um, and yeah, I just love the, the color and the, the architecture, the Baroque and neoclassical architecture in here. Um, there you could, uh, get a shot of the Guanajuato Basilica. One of the most iconic buildings in yeah. all of Mexico. <laughs> wow. Uh, it's a stunning building. Yeah. It's storm has it in here. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the colors as well. I will never forget, you said this to me on stream previously, of all the houses being different shades, and it's so gorgeous. Yeah, and you can't have the same color house next to each other. Mm -hmm. I like that they all taking their own little um, off routes as well. And just sort of like coming out of nowhere. Yeah, that's the thing about these uh, showcase opponents. They will do anything mm -hmm. to win. Um, Always up, always up to tricks, aren't they, Andy? <laughs> yep. You've always got to keep keep the player second guessing what's going there. Oh, absolutely. So we're right up in the in the northern tip of the map at the moment as well. Uh, so yeah, we'll get a glimpse of the canyon, but we'll take a closer look later. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> what happened there? <laughs> So that bike knew he was beaten. He knew he didn't have a chance. So he has, uh, he has switched to a wingsuit for the, uh, the final stretch. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> oh, very good. He probably had us beat if he was willing to face plant into the road there. <laughs> <laughs> 